right, what a great good stuff we have for you. The Department of Veterans Affairs is rolling out a new technology to aid our wounded warriors. It's a bionic arm named after Luke Skywalker, and it can do things that a normal prosthetic just can't. Joining us now is the Secretary of Veterans Affairs, David Shulkin, and Fred Downs, a multi-decorated, four-time Purple Heart U.S. Army veteran, served in Vietnam, was wounded there, and has the bionic arm. Gentlemen, first, it's good to have you here. Thank you, and thank you for your service. Um, tell us about the arm. All right, well, it's, uh, I control this arm with my feet, and so I have IMUs down here. So you have these sensors on the boots. They're relevant to this. They are, because I control the arm by moving my feet, and when I do that, they send wireless signals up to 10 computers in here. So, for instance, now I lift the, my foot and the, wow. over the grip like this. I rotate my foot. It rotates the hand. On my left foot, now I lift it and it rotates the wrist like this. And, and then, can, can you grip things? Yes, can you, I can. can you I have hold a hand? I have four grips. Wow. Now what I can do is I'll open this up, and oops, then I'll switch to. Um, oh, here I got. Here we go. That's incredible. Just wait just a second. I'm going to show you something here, and I'm going to shake your hand. All right. Just in case it gives you the death grip, I'll do it. <laughs> Ready? No, not yet. This, <laughs> the death. The, okay, here we go. Close like this. Oh, that's a good strong. <laughs> that is a strong grip. There we go. You oh. owe me for this. Let me shake up here. <laughs> so this would be the Boy Scout handshake with the left hand. Obviously, we always yeah. use the right hand. How big of a difference does this make for you in your life? Well, it's made a big difference because I'm now more independent than I was before. I can grasp things now for the first time. Yeah. With my left hand, with the hook, it just works with a rubber band and I can only do so much with it. This increases my independence, my ability to take care of myself, mm. my ability to do things with my hands like working in my workshop or working in the kitchen doing cooking and uh, my wife says I should do that more. <laughs> <laughs> but that is part of the value of this and also it is a tremendous leap forward in technology that now is leading to more development, better control systems that will work from nerves in the, in the muscles that I have left here. My arm is gone here, but my signals are still going down from my brain to my arm and my hands. So what they're doing now is they're, in the research part, they're piercing these out, piecing these out and taking the nerve endings and putting them in the muscles, putting sensors on them, and those sensors are sending signals directly to the wireless, to the arm. It's like just by thinking. incredible. I mean, it really is incredible to see. You feel like it looks like out of a movie or something. Literally, I, Star I, Wars. I, yeah, right? it really a little bit does. Of hence, hence, the, hence the reference, I guess. How much of a game changer is this for it, wounded vets all over America? This is a big deal, and this is why the VA exists. We do this type of research. It's been years of research to be able to bring this, and today we're actually rolling this out to veterans, and it's making a big difference in people's lives. Now, what is this a reflection of in terms of the commitment to our fighting men and women? Before we started this segment, full disclosure, we were saying very often everybody says they support the troops, but that support isn't there when they need it, when mm -hmm. they get back home to repair the body, the mind, the spirit, their finances. What does that mean to you with the VA? Well, this is what every American wants. This is why we exist, to bring the very best technology to our veterans. We want our wounded veterans to return to normal, healthy lives, and this is the way that we're doing it. So, how long did you have to go? What did, you said you were using a hook before I this? I used a hook on, on, for 49 years That's now. quite an upgrade. <laughs> and this is a big upgrade, and it's the first upgrade I've had in 49 years. But... Uh, the VA gave this to me yesterday. I've been testing a part of the. Oh, you only oh, got so it you're yesterday. New on this. Well, I, I am new on this one. This is the VA arm. Uh, I've been testing it for DARPA and DECA for oh, eight okay. years through All the right, research good. phase. Don't want to like mislead you here, but that's one of the beauties of this. Is now it's available to all veterans. It's available also to civilians, and uh, that is part of what the VA does so well. We invest in technology to help our disabled veterans has a ripple effect, then it would help civilians. This is Independence Day. 